welcome back to my No Torches uh, run of Darkest Dungeon. And if you watched my last episode, you will know that I lost uh, quite a lot of people to the Hag, uh, my Crusader, and uh, Bounty Hunter, and my Healer. So I will need to replace them. So let's check out the stagecoach. So, I mean, I can uh, get them all, but at the same time, I think. A mighty sword arm anchored by holy purpose. A zealous warrior. I don't think I really need more grave robbers. But I guess I can. To those with a keen eye, gold gleams like a dagger's point. I guess I can uh, hire her. Since it doesn't cost any money. So since I have almost no money I will have to do some easy quests. Like uh, this one. A short one. I think. So... Let's try it. like that hmm. yeah play doctor can come as well and the occultist perhaps this group is lacking in damage and healing but uh, I'm hopeful they can do something at least so since I don't bring any real healer, I will have to bring a lot of food. Something like that. The fiends must be driven back. So we have what to. What better place to begin than the seat of our noble line? So we have to complete all the room battles. Easy enough. Great start. Ambushed by foul invention. It's a lot of stress already. No findings. Okay. Let's carry on. And we have our first room battle. At least we surprised them. So let's see what. Uh, skills my play doctor have. You have a stun and a, and an AOE poison and a, a melee attack with bleed. So uh, you got a lot of different kind of skills I would say. Mm. Let's try to go with uh, poison. Since I want to kill the stress guys first. Nice. The fiend falls. A faint hope blossoms. Mm. Can uh, throw a dagger. Or can use a stun. Uh, let's just try a throwing dagger. Almost kill. Perhaps my occultist can finish him off. Confidence nice. surges as the enemy crumbles. A devastating blow. So now the surprise turn is over, so they will start to attack me. Let's try to kill the brawler first. I think he will do the most damage and he also has less uh, HP. While this defender has his shield bash that stuns me. So let's try to stun him instead. 
and go for a heal on my play doctor. So that's a net gain at least. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. And uh, this attack give uh, bonus damage to stunned enemies, so I I'll use it while it's stunned. Try some more healing. Playing really safe. The launch attack. And another melee attack and he's dead. A trifling victory. But a victory nonetheless. But it seems like it's more room battles. Stop is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. So yeah, at least I have one shovel. And now it's a fight again. So these two are the easiest guys in the dungeon. So I can try to focus on the courtier. Two. <laughs> yeah, nice. A debuff on these guys. I don't know if it's really necessary. I can keep on stacking them, I guess. Minus 50% damage. And his body is dead. No resist. Uh, no, no, <laughs> no bleed on him. So. Skeletons are quite creatures can be felled, they can be beaten. The skeletons are quite resistant to bleeds, I have to say. So let's check out this room. Um, okay, you can check the bookshelf, I guess. Oh, we got a negative quirk. Let's check the display cabinet instead. No. Okay. And we have a fight. So again, I, I will try to bring the Arbalist to the front two rows, so we will do less damage. And the easiest way to do that is to kill the Bone Rabble. on him as well and then focus on the defender there's a stun attack now I have my play doctor in the front but I can use lunge to attack and move forward at the same time try another curse nice Only two damage. And he is debuffed, so he will do less damage as well. Let's try a heal on my Plague Doctor. Nice. Almost full health. Try to kill the Bone Defender now. Okay. I can only use my stun attack from the front row. Yeah, this isn't the quickest uh, well struck. Quickest group when it comes to uh, high DPS. I mean, killing three uh, skeletons takes forever. Oh, I should have used the other, other attack. Well, well, well. Nice. I like As the fact that. Uh, 
So too will resistance. I like the fact that kind of like the casters can use melee attacks as well as the other guys. Nothing to see. Okay, let's carry on. Should uh, yeah, I get uh, to eat some soon, I guess? Just play it safe. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Nice, some more loot. I still haven't got a lot of money from this run. It's only like 1000 or something. A little bit more. Spider should be easy enough, and I surprised them even with uh, zero zero light. So he's bleeding, but only one damage per turn. Nice. This expedition. Okay, so that's a lot of money from two spiders. And we have another fight. So, uh, yeah. Hmm. Might even focus on the cutthroat instead of the Fusilier. That's right. It's almost dead. Nice. I can try to use uh, the stun attack on the fusilier or the plague attack. Let's just go with the stun. Nice. And I uh, dodge, that's good. Now she has the accuracy buff from uh, Throne Daggers. A nice crit. This uh, run is going quite well. Try to get some bleeds in. Nice. But it's a really, <laughs> really, really weak bleed. At least the debuff landed as well, but it still hit, and that's a lot of bleeds. So I mean, uh, I'm bleeding for a total of nine HP from one attack. A now, victory. I could have used uh, the toxin point. trickery to try to cure the bleed, but it's only two a HP. Strike. And this wasn't the last, uh, the last fight. So wealth we beyond measure. Have to check the next room as well. The foolhardy alike. Trap. Okay. Let's check the bookshelf. Nothing there. Okay. If only treasure nice. could more loot. the flow of otherworldly corruption. I will have to keep four food if I get the you have to eat dialogue. Okay, so we have two more fights. I got blighted and I have no anti no anti venom. Just try to kill the small ones first. Oh. Gotcha. 
attack me once. Now I will try to use some heals. Let's check the bleed uh, resistance on my characters. 40%. Only 20% on the Plague Doctor. So yeah. I will need the heal on my grave, grave robber most. So. Finish the skeleton. Thank you. He gets to attack me once more. And that's a really nice hit. 10 damage without the crit. And uh, zero, zero heal as well. Okay. Mm. And he resists the stun as well. Try another heal, that's better. And he's dead. Remind and some more food. I might need that. Okay, he will use the, his confession booth. Let's go, last fight. So we will do the stress attack. 19 stress. That's quite a lot. That's some nice damage from the occultist at least. And, um, let's just try to kill them first. Like that. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I, mean, I mean, the play doctor is mostly about attacking the back two rows. Two of his attacks are uh, AOE attacks. Well, let's just. Uh, Go on the bone soldier, I guess. I will not be able to. Perhaps I am able to kill the bone courtier even before you can do another attack. That's good. Really nice. And a stun attack. But my bounty hunter resisted the stun at least. Let's try to finish the bow soldier like that. And, uh, then we just have to kill the bone defender and then we are done with this quest. The debuff, nice. And the melee attack from my plague doctor. He has a lot of HP really, takes some time to bring him down. But now he's dead, or dead again I guess. So we are done with this quest, that's nice. And we got a lot of loot this time. More bones return to rest. Let's see. Devils remanded to their abyss. Yeah, 10,000. A lot of crests. That's a nice perk. And that's even better, better I would say, almost. And that's so I'm really lucky with the quirks I got. Three three positives. I see something long absent in the sunken faces of passers-by. A glimmer of hope. So yeah, I will have to try to build up my team a little bit more before I can take on the hag again, but we will try another run next. 
episode. So I'll see you then. Bye.